What is going on, buddy? Dan on filter checking out. Alter Bridge. Blackbird. It's a lyric version, so if it if the lyrics are fucked, I didn't make it. <laughs> Someone else did. And I I remember Alter Bridge. I've heard of them. I was still listening to music when they became a thing, when Creed died and Alter Bridge was born. Cause aren't they just Creed? But without Scott Stapp? That was his name, right? Scott Stapp? I just remember he was he was kind of he became like a douchebag over time. He was like kind of a arrogant asshole, I think is what people said. So they, they kinda of kicked him out and they became Alter Bridge. Even though Creed did have some hits though. My sacrifice is fire. But anyway, uh I, I was like, okay, I remember hearing about Alter Bridge, so I, I looked up like about when I was before I stopped listening to music, so what song could I have heard from them? Like, on the radio or something. The album One Day Remains, there's like, Open Your Eyes. I don't, it doesn't ring a bell. Find the Real, definitely not. Broken Ring, Wings, doesn't ring a, a bell. I'm like, maybe? The the next album would be the, the only one that has a shot. Because after 2007, no way. Because I, I really wasn't listening to music like that. Definitely not like, on the radio. So the Blackbird album, Definitely haven't heard Blackbird. Rise Today, maybe. That would that's the only one that the title kinda rings a bell, but that could just because be because Rise Today could be a, a song title by a thousand bands. So it might not even be them. Like that's a very vague and used a lot song title. So I don't know. Watch over you, no. Before tomorrow comes, no. So I may not have ever heard Alter Bridge. I just remember, maybe I just remember the name because of the whole Creed uh, bullshit. So let's check this out. Blackbird. This comes from Matt. Matty H, appreciate you, appreciate you, homie. A lot of H's were being used there and it kind of fucked me up. Let's check out Alter Bridge. That does sound like a Creed guitar. It does. The willow it weeps today. Mm. A breeze from the distance is calling your name. And for your black wings and wait across the horizons coming. It's coming to sweep you Not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad. Just singing softly. Cool. Cool. I was like, ah, this, I didn't know if the whole song was to be a soft or is he going to show any power? Because when you're low key replacing Scott Stapp, you got to have some power. And I know that it's not Creed. It's Alter Bridge. But still, the first thing that's come going to come to the mind is you're kind of replacing Scott Stapp. Got to have power.
go. There we go. Come on. Woo. He's still singing. Drummer playing, you rarely see this, especially anymore. Drummer playing the little his sticks, but on like the the rim of one of the uh, of one of the snare drums. Talk to me. Don't touch him. That was a much like more difficult solo than I expected. Like when it you know the, the lyric thing popped up, said guitar solo coming, and you could feel it about to to, to come in. I was like, okay, cool. This song it's emotional. It fits to have a nice like one of those high pitched guitar solos that wavers, and it's more about it's a simple but more about bringing out an emotion than it is actually like really like melting faces and difficulty he kind of did both like it started emotional and then it kind of got fucking difficult he actually cooked
Woo! Reset. Damn! That was pretty damn good. Let it ride. Let it ride. That was damn good. That was pretty damn good. And they, the singer could go. He can fucking go. And that is important when, again, I know, again, it's not Creed. It's Alter Bridge. Completely different band. God. But still, the first thing that's going to come to most people's minds when they know this, this fact you're kind of just plugging in a different singer. So the singer's got to be able to fucking sing like really well. Or everyone's going to be like, ugh, that's a step down. Like even if it's a good singer, if he's not really, really good, it's going to feel like a, a step down because Scott was a douchebag. Yes. But the man can fucking sing. Like sing, sing. This guy can sing. He sounds kind of like the Shine Down guy. I'm terrible with names. But doesn't he? A little Shine Downish, which is a compliment. Shine Down can really fucking sing. Good song. And the best part about this song is somehow they found a song and the way it was put together. I couldn't imagine Scott Sapp singing this. And that's step one <laughs> when you're doing that. When you're changing bands, that's still like 80%. The same people, just without the singer, is you, you want the vibe to kind of shift, like to where it's like, no, he couldn't have done this song. I don't think he could have. This isn't his vibe at all. I couldn't picture Scott Stapp's tone doing this song. It would throw it all off. This worked. This was really good. Emotional, yet... The guitar riffs, especially late in the song, even though it's an emotional song, they kind of had like a, not sinister, but kind of a dark vibe to them. Like as it's going away, as it's going, like the outro. I like that. Nice little detail. Good stuff, man. Good stuff. Alter Bridge. They've been around about 20 years. I remember hearing about them. They were big news when it first happened. Just because Creed was so big. And heard about them, never heard them. Now I know what they sound like. Creed, but with Shine Down Singer, kind of. <laughs> That's kind of the vibe I'm getting here. I'm good with that. Hit like, subscribe. Blackbird, good stuff. And the song was eight minutes, it did not feel like it. It's not easy to do. Eight minutes, a lot of times, can feel long. That didn't. That felt like, I would have guessed 4.15. A normal 4 minute 15 second song. Huh. I'm trying to think of what, 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 did the solo last that long? Did it eat up the time? Because even that didn't feel like overly long. Oh, that's how you know a song's pretty good is when it can be long and it doesn't, you don't notice. If you are still here, then you are a real one. I think this was a perfect introduction to them. But I still don't know what they're... Like, you gotta hear more than just one song of a band to know their sound. But I th think this was a good way for me to kind of get a gist. Kind of get a gist. A real one.